Welcome to this week's installment of the Two Minute Drill. We're here with Nichols football head coach Dale Olmstead. The Bison are coming off a of bye week. Before that, they played at Western New England, had a tough loss. Dale, let's just quickly recap that game against the Golden Bears. Yeah, I mean, uh, you know, West New England, Keith Emery does a great job. That program's on the rise. There's a reason why they're number one in New England. Um, you know, they're undefeated. They're a very tough team. Our game plan going into that game was to utilize the clock as best we could, and we really did that. The first half, I mean, anyone that looks at the paper sees the final score, 49-6, to six, doesn't really understand the whole you know, the whole game. Um, you know, it was 14 nothing. Uh, just about to go into the half. They score with two minutes to go. We get the ball. We bring it down to there, 25, and just kind of kind of stall there. But it was a back and forth game in the first half. Um, we were hoping to hoping to get out of there. You know, with maybe this down 14 nothing, getting the ball in the second half, and and giving them a run for the money. And I think we did for through about three quarters. Then then towards the end, it got a little out of control. Um, but you know, for our perspective, what you know, we were able to play everybody that game, get everybody in. We're still moving forward. We still worry about ourselves. And um, there was certainly a lot of positive we could take we could take out of that game, and and we we've done so. So you know, we're looking forward to next week. A lot of the students went home for the weekend. It was Columbus weekend. Kids got a couple days off, get refreshed, clear their heads, get back to practice, back to basics. Talk about the bye week. Yeah, I know. I, you know, last year we had our bye week with about three games to go. It was a long season. This year, getting it at this point, you know, it certainly gives us an opportunity as a staff and as the players to kind of go home and, you know, just kind of forget about football for a little bit and, and, and get, you know, just go home. The kids that are in Jersey and, and sort of New England, actually we had a kid from Florida fly back home. So, you know, it was great. It was great for those guys to go home, uh, come back, uh, you know, refresh, kind of hit that reset button, you know, learn from what you did the first half. But, again, get ready to take on the second half of the season so the bye week you know the to the ad's thank you i think it happened at the right time you know the whole league had a bye week so i think everybody in the league will be fresh but for our perspective you know you can see it in the field this this last couple of days when we we're out there the kids are flying around the coaches are you know a lot of energy not like there wasn't before but there's certainly I, I think we're ready to go for the second half of the season for sure second half opens up on saturday against a curry team out in milton mass it's also looking for the first conference win What's the key to victory? Um, you know, execution, you know, like it is as always. Um, you know, both teams are very similar. We both have one victory, actually against the same opponent, uh, coincidentally. So, you know, they're, they're both very similar. I'm sure they're eager to play us. Um, you know, looking back at last year's film, we turned the ball over five times. You know, we, we can't do that. We won't beat anyone that way. You know, we're going to just stay focused, you know, execute when we need to execute, um, you know, play good defense, ball control. Um, and you know, hopefully we can get a couple big plays, and, and, and maybe that be that the difference maker. But I think this game will come down to the fourth quarter, last possession, and hopefully we'll come up on top. Fans, the contest begins at one o'clock out in Milton, Mass. If you can't make it out there, NicholsAthletics.com has a webcast as well as live stats for you to follow. Thanks, Coach. Good luck. All right, thank you.